A, for your consideration, Board of Election personnel request. Ms. Cox, you're in the audience. Come forward, please. Good morning. Good morning, sir. And you have uh, a request that you'd like to make for us? Yes, sir. I'd like to reorganize the office, trading five part-time personnel for one full-time personnel. Okay. <coughs> Any questions for Ms. Cox from the commission? How will that affect, excuse me, mm -hmm. question. Go ahead. How will that affect you financially, your budget in your office? Actually, 4.49 part-time personnel equals one full-time personnel in the position. So it will benefit the county by half a person. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I have a question. Do you mind sharing with us then it, um, as far as the reason why you wanted to reduce from the five part-time and go to one full-time other than the, uh, the financial issue of, of the savings there? Yes, sir. The one work hour of a full-time person is not one work hour of a part-time person. The job has evolved over the last five, ten years even, to a situation where it requires a high degree of technicality, a high degree of complexity, training, testing out of training at a state level, certification. So the jobs part-time people were hired to do, <coughs> file clerks, uh, are not acceptable for what we need done right now. So we're in the situation where the full-time people are working excessive hours, overtime hours even, uh, to get the work done because the part-time people can't do that. It's hard to get a 725 an hour person off the street to do what we need them to do. Run our few systems just like they do over at RDC, uh, manipulate multiple simultaneous systems like Department of Motor Vehicles, criminal databases, uh, other counties databases, compare and contrast those, make decisions. It's hard to get a part-time person to do that. And that's just one example of many. Do you, do you see this as satisfying your employment needs for how long? For the foreseeable future. Uh, we don't know what the state's going to do. Like all the other offices, we're getting work pushed down from the state level continually. Uh, at this point in time, you know, we've had one full-time position deleted, and we were amenable to that. We're trying to help with the county. But for the foreseeable future, unless something drastic happens, that should fix us up for a good while. Are there any other questions for Ms. May? Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Appreciate you coming. I see you've got your board back there. Thank you all for coming as well. Okay, we'll move on to 6B is the contract.